Hey everybody, welcome back to Just Keep Scuba Diving, Scuba Diving on a Budget. I appreciate you being here. My name is Chris. I, my job is to try to help you save money and enjoy the sport of scuba diving at the same time. I know that's a crazy concept. It's just really out there. Who ever thought of such a thing? If you like what I'm doing, go ahead and hit the like and subscribe button. And now, let's get into the video. Today was requested by Natalie with Natalie W.I.V. One of the YouTube questions and she was like, where did you get the red filter for the high wheel case or for the case? Um, she actually watched my video over the second one on the setup of the high wheel case. I have it in the floor. Um, I appreciate that question and what she is talking about is, bam, this little filter right here. I actually got this little filter off of Amazon for $14.99 and let me show you where it's at. this is from kit dive $14.99 $14.99 it is a prime exclusive so and I am not a prime affiliate so I'm not making any money off of this this is it has it has cam dive on there too and kit dive it is a 32 millimeter lens so if you can find a 32 millimeter filter that will probably work i just it was on there as recommended so i bought it and you know 14 dollars compared to everything else we pay for is not a bad thing so let's just show you how you put it on okay so here we got the magenta filter red filter Basically, spins on like this. Bam. Done. Problem I see is, is trying to do this while in the water. I guess you could use your rinse bucket and do that in the rinse bucket and have the water in between their two red lenses, or two lenses. There's supposed to be no air there. Um, just the way it is. But, there you go. That is the magenta filter. All right, and we're back. So, I did see some problems. One, can you imagine trying to do that with dive gloves in the water? So, I guess my suggestion should be, until I try to do this, my suggestion should be is maybe put it on in the rinse bucket, so that way, because it's supposed to have some water in there. I just, you know, I, I have not used this yet, so I don't know exactly what's the easiest way to do this. My next dive, I'm going to, I will. The next thing is also, let me show you some pictures. So this first picture is of through the high wheel case with the iPhone X without the filter. Okay picture, it works okay. This is through the iPhone high wheel case, iPhone X with the filter. Now if you look up in the top left hand corner, there's going to be a black mark. That's the curvature of the actual filter cover. Um, there's nothing I can do about that. I tried moving the phone, I tried everything I could, and it doesn't work. Um, that mark is still there. So I don't know if you can crop it out, but what it's going to mean is, is you're going to have to s offset your camera on the subject that you're sending because you've got to get that picture. I mean, come on. You got bought this case and this filter for a good picture. The next thing is video. So here is video, three seconds without the camera case or without the filter in the case good job here is three seconds with the camera case and the filter there's that mark again now the problem i'm seeing is iphone x only not the xr not a single lens it's the dual lens that right there i don't know which one of these i think it's trying to look through this one the problem is, is i don't know how the iphone sets up on which lens it fits on now if one of you knows how to make it go to this bottom lens I'm sure this is a great lens for it I don't know how to make it go there the video doesn't work the camera doesn't work it stays on the top lens maybe HDR I don't know I don't know how to set it over to that um, 4k 4k takes a lot of video possibly because I set it on 1080 I don't set it on 4k um, <clears throat> It just takes a lot of 
processing power on my laptop to make that happen. Eventually I'm going to do 4K, but my laptop's not able to process that without doing skips and jumps. I hope you like and I hope you like what I've been doing. If you do, hit the like and subscribe button. That is the magenta filter from Kit Dive. Just keep scuba diving, scuba diving on a budget. Have a good day, guys. See you next week.